Hello, I'm Jordan Mosca, and today we'll be looking at what makes Holy Trinity athletes tick. This is Titan Talk. So, Andrew Farrick, do you prefer Andrew or Randy? Randy, I guess. Okay. So, Andrew, what sports did you play this year? Uh, I played volleyball. Uh, I played football, hockey, and lacrosse. I played football, soccer, I played a bit of basketball. Soccer, I was injured for most of hockey and basketball. Uh, I played senior girls basketball, junior girls volleyball, and track and field. I played junior soccer, senior volleyball, and senior soccer. Uh, I played junior football, junior basketball. So who's your biggest inspiration for sports this year? Well, it's, it's not like just one of them. It's uh, I, got, I got a couple. You know, I've got uh, all my coaches from this year. Uh, it's got to be my dad because he was a four-sport athlete in uh, high school and a two-sport athlete in university. Oh, inspiration is probably just, you know, the school, you know, coming out with all the games, all the games we've played, um, giving nice Titan spirit, you know. Probably Jesus, you know. Help me. Help me. Keep on going forward and stuff. Megan Parada. I would say is my biggest inspiration. Mine too. Yeah? Yeah. Mr. Six Zero. Mr. The Savages. It's a great lacrosse coach. I would have to say my father. Definitely. What were your most memorable moments out of the sports year? Uh, most memorable moments? Definitely uh, for football. Probably throwing that touchdown pass against Corpus in the uh, semifinals and baseball. Just having a great time with the boys. Uh, definitely winning OFSA. Winning the Notre Dame, Notre Dame game when we went double overtime. Personal number one was when Catherine Cardhouse destroyed a girl on the other team by uh, trampling her body. It was pretty memorable. Um, definitely making an offset for volleyball and soccer and one winning offset for soccer. Describe us your first big run in football. Well, it was a windy day. We are at Notre Dame, pro approximately uh, 4.30, 4.35. Uh, got the ball on the 20-yard line, ran it all the way back to their 20-yard line. I'm there right now. It was, it, was, it was a beautiful run. I think uh, repeating as Halton Champs for soccer was good. Winning our basketball Halton Championship was great. So. I won the intramural dodgeball tournament Did you? Year. I think I actually came out with you plans. How is that moment better than mine? What do you think separates Titan athletes from other athletes? Oh, Titan athletes are a cut above. You can see it, um, you know. You can see it off the ban banners hanging in our gym, but we're just a cut above. Because Titan athletes are clearly the best athletes ever. No question. Well, we're just better. <laughs> Titan athletes is, we're just the top notch athletes, better than, I don't want to say names, but like we're just better than all schools, STA. But you know, we do what we can, you know? Titan athletes from any other athlete. The black and gold. So you played multiple sports, nominated for two awards. So what I'm trying to ask you is, do you believe there's a Bigfoot? Uh, no. Do you believe in Bigfoot? No. Do you believe in Bigfoot? Yes. Bigfoot, maybe. Sasquatch, definitely. You see Mr. Roberts at the side of the road. His car is broken down, yours is working fine. Do you pick him up? Yes. Wrong answer. Do you pick him up? Yes. Wrong answer. Do you pick him up? No. Good. Do you pick him up? Yeah, hell no. Good. Right answer. Why do you think you deserve to win an award this year? Come on. I think I've worked hard and for what I want, and I've also helped the team, and I think I'm a pretty good leader. Like, well, like you said yourself, I was a three-sport athlete, and I helped my team as many ways as possible. I so. never said that. I always give it my all. I've known to put. I've been known to play with my my heart, and uh, I always give, give it my all. I don't know. I've, I've seen all some right. poor efforts. All right, all right. Sorry, son. If Hollywood made a movie about you, who would you like to see play your role? Brad Pitt. If Hollywood made a movie about you, who would you like to see play your role? Um, Miley Cyrus. Beyonce. Who would you like to see play you? I'm gonna go with Adam Sandler. Yeah, that's the worst one yet. <laughs> seems like a okay. seems like a Charlie uh, Sheen. <laughs> Your other sibling, Patrick, is also a nomination for an award this year. What makes you better than him, or do you have any personal stories explaining why you would be better than him? Well, I was born first, so that automatically makes me better. You just gotta look at the numbers, man. How many assists did he have? How many goals did I have? That's how you go. Up. Jerry still thinks girls have cooties. In football this year, I received a concussion so bad 
I literally saw myself floating above my body. It was another <laughs> body experience. Sorry, side effect from the concussion. <laughs> kind of like an out of body experience. Sorry, side effect from the concussion. Can't believe I'm interviewing Siobhan McNeil. Take your time, time. it's cool. Interviewing Siobhan McNeil. Sorry, I gotta tweet this. You know, I'll tweet right now. That's a message. Interviewing Siobhan McNeil, lol. Possible. Hashtag dreams come true. So, quarterback for the football team, propelling us to multiple wins. Poster boy for the baseball team. Some speculate that your performance this year was a little too good. So, I was wondering if you could. You want me to, uh. You want me to? Oh, no, no. <laughs> I just wanted some water. That would have been a terrible mistake. Yeah. Well, intimidation is a huge factor in any game. So we'd like you to stare into the camera and give us your game face. That's good. That's terrifying. Would you mind looking into the camera and giving us your game face? <laughs> um. <laughs> That was really terrifying. <laughs> and give us your game face. Game face. Nice. Game face. You look confused. Would you mind giving us your game face? Not really have a game face, but... No? It's just like more moody than anything. Game face speed. Just the head tilt. I'm sorry. Like you're in. Like, Can I take a picture and ask for the permission? And y'all really have to, homie. It's your decision. So nervous. Showing your friends is the only purpose. And you just wanted something that would make it all worth it. Well, here's a picture. I would gladly oblige.